everyone now we are going to do the vlan lab so here i will put the requirement your manager told create the vlan 20 and give the name as it okay and your manager told create another vlan that is vlan 10 give the name as hr so now we need to do this configuration so how we are going to do we are going to do by, by using the vlan commands so first of all let me put some different colors so easily we can understand which machine is in which VLAN example this machine is in different VLAN and this machine is in the same VLAN means same color means same VLAN we can say and then I will take this color okay and we can say this PC is in that VLAN this PC is in that VLAN and also if you want I can put like this so you can say this green color is VLAN 10 and the other sky color whatever the other color we are using that will be in the vlan 20 okay this way we can differentiate so your manager told create two vlan vlan 10 and 20 and put this pc in the vlan 20 and put this pc in the vlan 10 same thing we need to do here so now let's do this lab and we need to create the trunk port already i created the trunk port here in our previous lab no issue i'm going to show you that one also so let me go to the switch and now i will create the trunk so if you want here let me make this here small so you can easily understand but if you see the topology then easily you can understand so here see here i am here you i hope you can see this one i am here in the switch one now your manager told we need to create the to VLAN so VLAN 20 so I will write here VLAN 20 and he give the name as IT so I will write here IT then he told create the VLAN 10 so I will write VLAN 10 they told name as HR so I created HR so now we have the two VLAN but if you see this PC PC5 we need to put in VLAN which VLAN VLAN 20 okay so what I will do here I will check what interface is connected to PC5 fast ethernet 0 by 3 so i will go under that interface i will write interface fast ethernet 0 by 3 then i will write switch port axis okay switch port axis vlan which vlan they told they told vlan 20 so i will write here vlan 20 if you want to write switch port mode axis for security purpose we will put this also so now i put the fast ethernet 0 by 3 this interface fast ethernet 0 by 3 i put in which vlan i put in the vlan 20 now i have another if you see let me show you here okay let me move this here and let me show you this pc if you see this interface is fast ethernet 0 by 4 okay so i will go to the this interface interface fast ethernet 0 by 4 and here i will write switch port x switch port mode axis this one we will write first time and then we will write switch port axis vlan which vlan they told vlan 10 so i put this interface in vlan 20 this one in the vlan 10 if you want to check we can check also i will save the configuration then you can write show vlan brief so when you write the show vlan brief you can check here you have here vlan 1 by default all the ports are in the vlan 1 but now we created two vlan that is vlan 10 and vlan 20 so this port that is fast ethernet 0 by 4 this one is in the vlan 10 so this port is in the vlan 10 this fast ethernet 0 by 3 is in the vlan 20 so here everything is good now we've done our configuration correctly for the switch 1 now we need to do same thing for the switch 2 and also you need to create this interface as a trunk already in our previous class we created but if you have confusion let me write here we need to write interface range and fast ethernet 1 slash 2 because i am selecting these two interface and after that i will write here switch port trunk encapsulation dot 1q then switch port more trunk with this command we will make trunk so what i done here i taken this multiple interface this two interface and i make this interface as a trunk here so now this interface become as a trunk and this interface we assign in the vlan 20 this interface we assign in the vlan 10 so our configuration everything is finished in the switch 1 now we need to do the, for the switch 2 so what i will do i will go to the switch 2 and here if you see here in the switch 2 let me move here little 
so here this is a switch to what i need to do first of all i need to put this two interface in the trunk already it is there but anyhow let me show you because maybe you are watching this video only so i will write interface range f0 by 1 dash 2 and then i will write switch port trunk encapsulation encapsulation dot 1 q encapsulation dot 1 q switch port mode trunk okay so now with this two command i make this interface as a trunk after that what i will do i will uh, after that we will look the vlans so if you see your manager told this pc should be in the vlan 10 so you can see this is a fast ethernet 0 by 4 this should be in the vlan 10 so you can go under that interface i will show here you will write interface fast ethernet 0 by 4 and you will write here switch port mode axis then switch port axis vlan 10 okay vlan 10 because that color green color is in the vlan 10 so vlan 10 does not exist and they created the vlan 10 so before we forget to create the vlan but no issue if we did not create the vlan automatically they are going to create when you put that port in that vlan they are creating automatically but they will give the different name let me show you just now we did not create the vlan but we put that interface in that VLAN, so automatically they created that VLAN, VLAN 10, and they give this name. But if in your organization, you are using VLAN 10 for HR, so you can rename this one. How you can rename? You will write here uh, VLAN 10 and go here and write the name as HR. So now that name will change. If you write show VLAN brief, that name will change. If you see before what name you have here, before you have VLAN 001. Now, it is having HR. So now let me create another VLAN. I will write VLAN 20. A name I will give IT. Okay. So now let's do the configuration. Already we put this interface fast Ethernet 0 by 4 is in the VLAN 10. Now I need to move this interface. Interface fast Ethernet 0 by 3. So what I will do interface fast Ethernet 0 by 3. I will write here switch port axis which VLAN we told, we told VLAN 20. So I will write VLAN 20, switch port, mode axis, mode axis, okay. So now I put this interface in that VLAN, which VLAN, that is VLAN 20. Now we can check, we will write show VLAN brief. If you see here, we have this one. We have two VLAN, VLAN 10 and 20, and VLAN 10, we are saying that is HR, and if, we, if you see the interface, fast Ethernet 0 by 4, this one. So this is the fast Ethernet 0 by 4, we put this VLAN in HR and fast Ethernet 0 by 3, we put this VLAN in VLAN 20. What is the VLAN 20? That is IT, this one. So now the configuration is good and also we have the trunk already we created. If you want to check right show interface trunk. So this interface are the trunk. So no worries, no issue. Everything is good here. I can save the configuration and then what we will do, you can ping the PC and you can chunk, chuck. So if you see this is a PC, let me close all and take the new PC, this PC I will take. I think we have the IP address already here. So now I can ping from this computer to this computer. What is IP of this computer? 1.3. Okay, so 1.3. They are in the same VLAN, so they will work, no issue. So I will go here. I will write here ping and I will put the IP both this both machine are in the same vlan so it will work if you see this same color are in the same vlan so it will work it is working here okay it is working here if you want i will send again i will ping again if you see replies coming so pc5 is communicating with the pc7 both are in the same vlan so it is working no issue what we can say both are in the same vlan so it is working it is having what we can say we can say here let me click here and show you here again so what i am saying replies coming back so, uh, uh, replies coming back so we can say same vlan is communicating okay same vlan is working now let's try to ping this vlan what is the ip of address of this one 1.4 so this is different vlan now it will not work so we can do here i will write here ping and i will put this let me see and check here I write here ping 192.168.1.4 request timeout because they are in the different VLAN. 
सो वी नो दैट डिफरेंट वी लैन के नॉट कम्युनिकेट डिफरेंट वी लैन के नॉट कम्युनिकेट दैट्स वाई इट इज नॉट वर्किंग इफ यू वॉन्ट टू मेक द कम्युनिकेशन बिटवीन डिफरेंट वी लैन वी नीड टू कॉन्फिगर द एस वी आई स्विच वर्चुअल इंटरफेस वी कैन डू दैट इज इंटर वी लैन वी नीड टू डू वी नीड टू डू द इंटर वी लैन देन ओनली दे आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट वर्किंग सो नाउ वॉट वी लैन हियर वी लैन हियर हाउ वी कैन क्रिएट द वी लैन हाउ वी कैन असाइन द पोर्ट इन दैट वी लैन एंड वॉट वी लर्न हियर वी लर्न हियर लाइक हाउ वी कैन टेस्ट द वी लैन वी चेक द वी लैन सेम वी लैन आर कम्युनिकेटिंग डिफरेंट वी लैन आर नॉट कम्युनिकेटिंग सो आई होप इट इज क्लियर इन अवर नेक्स्ट क्लास वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ वी कैन डू द इंटरव्यू लैन ओके थैंक यू बाय